Okay guys, here's an update on the Camaro. It's been a while since you guys have seen it. Uh, since you guys last saw it, I've Plasti dipped the wheels black and the brake calipers white and haven't had any problems with any of it. It's been on for about a month or so. And sorry it looks a little dirty. It's because it is. Uh, I've had school and haven't really had time to clean it. But yeah, I did my wheels. I did my brake calipers and I did all the chrome. The chrome Camaro letters on the side made black. All the trim, all the bezels black, except for this the bow tie on the front and the back still has a chrome outline. All the black wheels, white calipers all the way around. The Plasti Dip had no problems with the heat with the brakes either. It's worked real well. Um, then on the inside, I have a new, I got the Metro kit, or Skosh kit, with a Kenwood DDX 719, uh, stereo. Show you how this works. I couldn't believe how much better the audio was in the car after getting the Kenwood like it made a really big difference the bass is way like sharper it's not as like it tamed the bass a lot um what else uh everything set up really well it took a while for me to actually hook all this up probably took me oh god with the wiring and everything, five or six hours. Um, everything fits real well though. And whenever you're buying the Skosh kit, it doesn't come with a radio, FM radio antenna adapter, which you're gonna need to get. It's only like, it can be anywhere from eight to $17. It's really cheap, but you're gonna need to get it. Cause I got mine and then I realized I needed it, so. I had to wait a couple extra days to actually put mine in because of that. But other than that, everything went in real well with that. Um, and I am working on getting... That's another thing. That just brings me to a point of... This thing, I don't like the sounds that it makes. Like the... the uh, whenever you open the door, the chime is really irritating. And let's see if I can... The turn signal noise. I'm not a big fan of it. I don't think it sounds good at all compared to stock, but I mean, whatever. You, whenever the stereo is playing, you can't even really hear it, so that's why I don't care very much. But, um, what else? Yeah, I plan on getting the 6x5s Kicker QS 65.2s on the six by the six and a half inch speakers on the front and i already have i don't know if you can see up there i'll walk up to them uh two kicker 693 six by nines with a kicker uh kicker amp i forget what it is i'll have to go up and see i think it's a zx 350.4 i think but I'll be installing those pretty soon. I already ran all the wires up through, and I just the reason I don't have it yet is you need mounts to put aftermarket six by nines in the back of the Camaro. So I'm waiting for those to come. It should be here in another week. Um, when I get them, I'll have another video up. But another thing I'm trying to do is my subs, the GM MTX. I'm actually looking at changing these out, so if any of you guys are interested in that, let me know, because there's nothing wrong with them, it's just, I'd want to have all my audio be the same brand, I want to have all kicker, and the, uh, the MTX is kind of throwing it off a bit, but, uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else you guys don't. All the Plasti Dip, which another thing, that's really easy to do, like really easy. But make sure on the wheels you do plenty of coats, because I realized if you do too thin, 
any rock that hits it chips it and then it just starts peeling so do thick layers like do I don't know five layers six layers of that stuff um I'm trying to think interior you've seen it's about it for what I have next right now next time you, you, you that you see it I'll have hopefully whole new audio I'll kick her in and honestly I do want to get vertical doors not so much for the vertical door reason it's just whenever people get in my car they always kick it down here because you can't open it people don't want to open it all the way out there because usually there's a car next to you and it hits it Another thing, I don't know if you guys can see where I park right there, but I'm next to a Mercedes and a wall. So I can't open my door very far, so the vertical doors would actually serve a purpose for me. <laughs> so that's why I'd be getting those. Um, oh, and since I last saw you, I got a throttle body from Apex Motorsports. It's a ported and polished throttle body. That made a huge difference in performance. I was very impressed with how much of a difference that made. Made the car a lot snappier. Sounds better even. Just because of the snappiness to the exhaust note. Um, that was 150 bucks. If you send back your old one as a core. As a, they have a, it's a core charge. So if you send back your old one. They give you $200 back. But your initial deposit is... 350 bucks I sent mine back and got the 200 bucks back so 150 bucks for what it does is pretty awesome um, and here's these speakers that's what I have to park next to that's why I want vertical doors because if I hit that uh, bad things <laughs> just bad things um, yeah kicker ZX 350.4 will be powering these and my six and a half inches and I think that's about it um, if you have any questions or anything just comment and if you like the Camaro and you like getting updates and stuff and you have questions about any of that just subscribe to me ask questions <laughs>